Hello out there, this is Jimmy Lard, the Sock Snob, and I'm coming to you with another video here. I've seen quite a few videos that have sort of upset me where people are turning neckties into bow ties. Now that idea does not upset me at all. The problem is seeing how people are overcomplicating this process and ending up with bow ties that look like neckties that have been turned to bow ties. So I'm going to show you a very simple method of doing this to uh, also make it look as if this is actually a bow tie. So sometimes bow ties can get pricey. So I understand when you don't want to do this or you may have a tie that you got as a gift or just not very attractive. But some unattractive neckties make very attractive bow ties. So I'm going to flip this over. And this is how we're going to start. So we're going to start, I have silk ties here. Both of these are silk ties. They are extremely thin and that is the best tie to use to convert to a bow tie because it won't be so bulky around the neck. So we're going to start with the larger end, this flap, where, and we're just going to flip it over to where that excess um, small end would have gone into the little loop here. So I'm going to place it there. Very simple, right? So far, so good. That's what we have. Then we're going to bring over this other piece. Very simple, right? So we brought over this other piece. Now I'm just going to bring it back. And all I'm doing, by the way, is making this the length of the bow tie that I want. All right. So now I'm going to bring back this piece. So pretty simple, right? So all I've done is a back and forth fold, back and forth fold. In fact, I'm going to redo it just so you can see it one more time. Very simple. So we flip over the first piece, then the second piece, then the third piece, now the fourth piece. And believe it or not, this alone is what's going to give it that authentic bow tie look because of these flaps. When you see the two pieces, that's what's going to make it look real. So every time I see these videos or these how to's where you end up with just one flap for the bow in the front, terrible, terrible, terrible look. So the next step, still very simple. We take this bow tie and we want to split this in the middle. There's a seam there. So all we're going to do is split this down the middle and make this half of the length. And we'll do this all the way. So I'm going to hold this in. I'm using my hand to hold it. And again, I have this piece split down the middle. So I'm going to go right down the center here. So I'm holding on to it here. I'm going to go right around this tie. And again, this is something else that makes it look authentic. Where you have this small piece, not this big fat whole tie going around. So this is what makes it look authentic. All right, so I pretty much have wrapped this around and I'm gonna bring this around and meet, except I wanna go under the piece that I was holding here. So I'm going under. All right, so far so good. So I have this is what I have so far with this little thin piece and I just came under. I can even start to tighten and even shape right now if I want, okay? So I'm just making these pieces even, doing a little bit of tightening right here, and the bow tie is already starting to come together, okay? So as you can see here, I'll straighten that out a little. Bow tie is starting to come together. Well, before we go any further, I wanna pull this sort of tight but I want to make the loop that goes around the neck. So I'm going to take this remaining piece of tie. And all I'm going to do is bring it around underneath all this that I've already uh, tied here. So it's just going to go underneath. Like so. And I'm going to bring it out on the other side and this by the way is going to be what makes our loop around our neck so so far so good right don't worry about this piece i'll show you how we hide that later 
All right, so now I'm dealing with this tie here, right? So it looks very much like a bow tie. It's pretty even on both sides. So all I wanna do is hold it right here, and then I wanna pull this piece that we already had to tighten it up. And as you can see, you have this piece, this piece, this piece, this piece. So it looks like an actual bow tie. So again, I'm holding and I'm going to tighten and tighten and tighten. And there we have it. We have made a bow tie out of a necktie. And then all you have to do then this part will go around the neck and you just simply tighten to make the neck piece as small or as wide as you want. And then this piece right here, all you'll do is just tuck it under the tie when it goes around your neck and then your collar flips down on top of it. How simple is that? And again, this then looks like an authentic bow tie and very simple. So like I said, sometimes the uh, ties that we use that are ugly as a necktie end up being a very attractive bow tie. And then you can mix this up and add a pocket square or something. And I would, I would, for something like this, I wouldn't do the same pattern. Do something else as a pocket square and bam, you are in business. So thanks a lot for watching me. Uh, log on to JimmyLard.com. Remember, I'm the sock snob. I give you everything travel, style, and culture. And leave me a comment, question, whatever you want. Thanks a lot. You have a good one.